Why? It's weird watching myself. I, I don't like how I look. I can't believe you don't realize how beautiful you are. I'm not going to sit here for that shit. <sighs> how does it feel now? Fine. You don't feel naked? You know what I mean. Tell me about being in the hospital. When I was 15, my dad decided to send me to military school. I told you this whole thing about structure and discipline. Of course I got kicked out. And when I got home, he and I had a huge fight. And he freaked out and hit me. The next day at school, some kid made a crack about my haircut. And I snapped. I wanted to kill him. And I would have killed him if they hadn't pulled me off. That's when my dad put me in the hospital and they drugged me up and I stayed there for two years. Wow, you must really hate him. He's not a bad man. Well, you'd better believe I'd hate my father if he did something like that to me. Oh wait, I do hate my father. Why? He's a total asshole. And he's got this crush on my friend Angela, and it's disgusting. <laughs> you rather he had a crush on you? Gross. No. But it'd be nice to be anywhere near as important to him as she is. I know you think my dad's harmless, but you're wrong. He's doing massive psychological damage to me. How? Well, I too need structure, a little fucking discipline. I'm serious though. How could he not be damaging me? I need a father who's a role model and not some horny geek boy who's gonna spray his shorts every time I bring a girlfriend home from school. Oh, Lamo. So someone should really put him out of his misery. Want me to kill him for you? Yeah, would you? It'll cost you. Well, I've been babysitting since I was ten. Have around three thousand dollars. Of course, I was saving up for a boob job. But I guess my tits can wait, huh? You know that's not a very nice thing to do. Hire someone to kill your dad. Well, I guess I'm just not a very nice girl then, am I? You know I'm not serious, right? Of course. Do you realize how lucky we are to have found each other? Tell me about being in the hospital. When I was 15, my dad decided to send me to military school. I told you this whole thing about structure and discipline. Of course I got kicked out. 
when I got home, he and I had a huge fight. He freaked out and. <laughs> Dad, just don't exist. <laughs> that was the best direction you've ever given. <laughs>